Flora study was a phase three clinical trial that compared head-to-head -head osimertinib, a new third generation EGFR inhibitor, to standard of care presently used drugs such as erlotinib and gefitinib. So as our viewers are aware of, osimertinib is approved in the US by the FDA for second line treatment of EGFR mutated patients. That's for patients who have developed a T790 mutation as a resistance mechanism to the first generation drug. What we try to do with the FLORA study is to move osimertinib to the first line and compare it head to head. And the hypothesis is it shuts off the resistance pathway. So we compared osimertinib in a cohort of 556 patients, double blind, placebo controlled, randomized phase three trial, one to one randomization between osimertinib versus either erlotinib or gefitinib. The primary endpoint of the trial was progression free survival as assessed by the investigator. And what we found was there was a clear superiority for osimertinib over standard of care. The numbers, median PFS with standard of care was 10.2 months, median PFS with osimertinib was 18.9 months. And the hazard ratio was 0.46, p-value highly significant. So this means a 54% reduction in the risk of death or progression with osimertinib. The second efficacy point to make is the duration of response was more than twofold higher for patients treated with osimertinib. With standard of care, it was 8.5 months. With osimertinib, it was 17.2 months. The third point is overall survival. We found that even though the data are very immature at this point, only 25%, the hazard ratio for overall survival is 0.63 with a p-value of 0.0068. Though not statistically significant at this time, a very promising trend. And that's important because we actually allowed crossover from the control arm for patients who develop progression in T790. We also found activity in the brain. Patients with brain metastases that came into the study had a very similar hazard ratio of 0.47 as the overall population, and similar to the hazard ratio in patients without brain metastases. So we show activity in the brain, we show robust PFS benefit, almost twofold improvement in duration of response, and a promising survival trend which is why we're excited about the results of Flora study.